Okay, so, um, hi, um, my name's Paulie, um, I suffer from Crohn's, um, and, um, essentially type 1 diabetes, and, uh, this is my first ever, um, video log, um, I've not done one of these before, um, but I was reading about Dynamo the Magician, and, um, I felt the need to perhaps say a few things, um, okay, so, so to start off, um, his main issue seems to be steroids at the moment, um, which they absolutely, totally suck. Um, uh, they save your life, and that's great, and if you need them, you need them. Um, and they're better to take them than the alternative, the side effects, but uh, the side effects are worth putting up with, but um, they really are hard. Um, now with me, um, I get into the, um, instead of like the Incredible Hulk, I'm like the Incredible Sulk. I'm like inconsolable. Um, and I think the world is crashing down and um, I think that I'm a Martian or something. Now I just don't understand the world when I'm on them. Um, they're really unpleasant. Um, they also mess up with your growth. Um, as you can see, I'm 34 years old and I don't really look 34. Um, and um, it's I've always looked younger than what I am, um, which I know that's good and bad depending on your point of viewpoint and your situation, um, but it's also messed up my growth. Um, my parents are both tall, but I'm short, sure. um, and it's messed up other areas of my growth as well, um, such as um, I wear an Apple Watch, and um, I've got a child strap, and even on the tightest settings, it is extremely loose. Um, so it's not great um, for that kind of things. Um, again, it's better than the alternative, which can be potentially death, really. Um, or really kind of continued um, a disease, um, so it's better than that, but um, it's no walk in the park. Um, I've no idea why people take these for bodybuilding and stuff like that, it's um, really not worth it. Um, and it can also cause arthritis, or well, Crohn's can, and the autoimmune. Um, diseases can do, uh, autoimmune um, medication can do that as well. Um, Crohn's and arthritis seems to go hand in hand. Um, I'm not sure about the studies behind that, but whenever, whenever I'm at the hospital, um, most people have arthritis um, who have Crohn's from my personal experience and what I see. Um, but going to Dynamo, um, I wish him like really the best of luck and that he can sort his life out. Um, I mean, he had a year ago um, food poisoning, which messed with, and it's still messing him up today. So it can be some like real serious shit. Um, he, he, if he's on the same sort of anti-inflammatory drugs as I'm on, then he's essentially got no immune system to fight uh, what's going on. Um, and that means if he catches a cold or um, catches a cough or something, it can develop into a lot stronger stuff uh, without him realising it. Um, I think maybe keeping off social media uh, would be a good goal for him, as he said. Um, I can totally relate to that. There's some days where I just want to delete all my accounts, but uh, most of my social life is through Facebook um, and various social medias. So I don't really want to cancel on that because then I have a lot less people to speak to um, but now I've got a job and during the day I'm working with people and the, I love everyone who I work with um, they're cool and friendly and chatty um, so um, I don't feel the need to go on social media as much um, although it's days where I feel really um, alone and really trapped and I need that social media to um, to get some sort of quantitative um, attention um, and to talk to people and to chat. And I know social media creates a sort of bubble world um, uh, around you. Um, and I like to hear viewpoints and lifestyles that aren't related to me. 
Um, so I sometimes follow groups that I wouldn't normally deal with or normally go with. Um, okay, um, so with the arthritis side of things, um, it's really um, it's one of those things where it's not the worst in the world for for me personally. Uh, I know for others it can be absolutely horrific. Like can't use your hands, you can't type, um, you can't um, cook properly because you can't chop up stuff, um, and uh, it's excruciatingly painful. Uh, but for me personally, my arthritis, if I have arthritis, I'm not sure, it's very low. I know when I get out of the car, I have to, it aches a lot when I get out of the car. And in the morning, it takes me about a couple of hours to get up um, because I'm uh, not, um, I'm just not able to function until my tablets have kicked in, my painkillers, I mean. Um, and then I'm ready to face the day. So I tend to get to work at about 11 ish or so. Um, but I stay late, and my boss is really cool, and I do work weekends um, sometimes to catch up on my work. Um, but that's um, that's my personal experience with arthritis. Um, I also find sometimes if I'm chopping, um, like vegetables and whatnot in the kitchen, I get like really achy hands. It's like a I don't know how to describe it. I can't move my hands. It's like a uh, my hands going to like a claw, and I can't move them. Um, and it's not 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 good news. Um, and because of all my other medication issues, uh, such as type one diabetes, type uh, mental health issues, and the Crohn's itself, um, it's just one more thing to deal with. Uh, one more lot of tablets and it's starting to add up too much um, I've got another video that I'm going to post later on with the um, Libri system which is absolutely amazing it's a life changer um, so that's my little blog for the to the, for today um, I'm hopefully going to do this on a more regular basis um, and you know that usual crap like me if it's thumbs up and whatnot um, send the comments and blah 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 um yeah because i like attention as everyone does um okay um that's basically it that's all i wanted to say today um i'm gonna hopefully make these little vlogs a regular thing um and that dynamo dynamo um i really hope that he can help with his issues and I can understand taking some time off, and I'm hoping he can work some magic that is within his. I mean, he's amazing at what he does, absolutely stunning. And I really, and I love that he's highlighted Crohn's for uh, a lot more people. Um, uh, and I hope uh, he can work out a way of doing his magic that doesn't. Um, doesn't hurt his hands as much or wherever his arthritis is mainly affecting him um, so anyway that's my um, video log for today um, thumbs up um, thank you for listening and that's it okay bye